Okay, hello. Uh, welcome to uh, Textiles. My name is uh, Kathy Freeman. I am the Senior Lecturer and Programme Leader for BA Honours Printed Textile Design and uh, Surface Pattern and also BA Honours Textile Practices. So two quite different courses but there's overlaps as well. Textiles is a very broad and dynamic subject which is why we offer two degrees. So our students go on to get employment, they become textile designers for fashion and also working interiors, also stylists, possibly merchandisers, buyers. I can just think about a few students that have recently gone on. Emma Corner is now freelance, but she works, sells work internationally, selling to Australia and America. Lucy, uh, who is also freelance. We have as well Sophie, who went on to work as a stylist for Princess Yachts. So she travels all around the world. Uh, we have two students who work at the moment at IKEA, and their names are Lily. Lily works as a merchandiser, and she styles a lot of the room sets. So as you go around IKEA, you can see those, and so she does. She does a, a lot of that. She absolutely loves her job um, and she's recently come back and talked to the students all about how she got that job and what she does on a day-to-day -day basis. Another student managed to secure a job at IKEA after, straight after she was graduated. She was working as an interior designer there. Recently we had another student who came back and talked to us um, who was Hannah Seawood. She's now working as a design assistant for, for moi. So there's lots and lots of different careers that you can go into as I say it is very broad and dynamic and we have quite a lot of live briefs as well many competitions we've worked with princess yachts who worked on an exterior design of a yacht which was really part of a marketing campaign to launch a new a new yacht uh, another unusual project was we got to design the exterior of a smart car so that's kind of is the surface pattern but obviously we, we design textiles as well we've been involved with a project a live project with Sainsbury's Home this year we've worked with Jules clothing and homeware company uh, about a year ago and also we worked with a more local company called uh, Finisterre which is a ethical and sustainable brand uh, for surfwear as well as recently working for um, Frugi uh, children's wear it, it's very very broad and that makes it really enjoyable for the students understanding you know what their career could possibly look like in the future. So uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about BA Honours printed textile design and surface pattern and just do a, 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 a little bit of an overview on that. So I would say that if you really love pattern and you start to notice pattern in everyday things and you are just notice the way colour works in certain situations and you enjoy looking at colour and you enjoy drawing. Obviously there's very many different kinds of drawing. I mean I'm just looking down at, at the moment I have a beautiful cushion here. Now when I say drawing I think this is a really good example because this isn't perfect by any means, it's not a perfect drawing but it's just right for textiles. It's got lots of beautiful marks. I think it's even got sort of dribbles of paint around here as well. So that's one aspect for textiles. But I've also, you know, things like this, a lot of things that you pick up are designed and they will have surface pattern on. The drawing styles that you might develop and we will work with you on this a sort of visual recording. Now it can mean that you're you know you're creating beautiful drawing that is realistic but I would say quite expressive as well. We really do not have a house style. We believe very much in nurturing our students. There's another quite a nice one here which is much more of a sort of graphic style Style. So many, many different things that, you know that you can use this degree on. So as I said before, we have 
really excellent industry links. And the reason for that is because, well, all of my team and myself have worked as designers. So we've just, over the years, we've just got those contacts. And we've, and we've also built on those contacts as well. Another aspect that is very important for many students is that we have fantastic studio and really fantastic workshop spaces. So we are based in mainly two rooms, but obviously they have, have full access to the whole of the college as well with many different workshops. We, we run workshops on Wednesdays where students can access different parts of the college. So if, for instance, you're a textile designer or and you want to work a little bit more with metal or you fancy trying your hand at that or any different sort of workshops that are available, you can do that. And, and that's really great because that adds to that richness as well. All the students have their own desk space, which is very important. All three years mix um, and there is a, a community in, in textiles. We do foster that idea of collaborating with each other as well. Our academic team of practicing design designers have lots of industry experience and they have excellent contacts and that obviously leads to live briefs which I've sort of discussed a little bit and inevitably work experience opportunities and going on to get employment and another thing that we do is that we really keep in touch with our alumni although we do have visiting lectures who are internationally or nationally known we also mix it up a little bit with recent graduates and finding out um, what they're up to so that they can speak to our students as well. Another thing that we do is that we visit trade shows as well, both national and international exhibitions. We offer trips abroad to students as well over the three years. So I was talking about collaborative briefs and work placements. This is very, very important because it really does build confidence and determination. And you can really see when students come back that they realise that they can do this. And it, it gives a great buzz to everybody else as well. So each year, every single year, you will have a personal project. So there are lots of workshops. So you will learn lots of, of skills and technical skills to do with textiles and producing design work but there is an opportunity for you to build on all of those skills and then take it into a much more of a personal uh, focus really. As a team I would say that we are very encouraging, we're very motivated, excited about textiles, we love textiles and anything to do with pattern and we really support and help our students so we make sure that we, we know who's been in, we know who is engaging with lectures and if somebody isn't then obviously we will encourage someone to come in and make sure that they do engage but we do that in a very holistic way and a caring way as well. Those students that really want to push themselves there's also lots of competitions available and lots of cross-college things as well to develop your personal and professional development skills. As I say, our graduates keep in touch and they come back to us and they give us vital insights into the industry and how it's changing, especially now. We've just gone through the whole lockdown and that's been incredible actually because there's so many creative people out there and there's so much of a determination to make this work and I think we, we feel exactly the same. So we also develop your skills in being in employable and also giving you the confidence to think I can do this I can get a job and I love what I'm doing really okay 